Hey everybody, the Bond guys back. Welcome to part 5 of Let's Play Alundra 2. Alright, in this episode, we finally made it inside the Ox Tank, which we believe the pirates had something to do with, but they're still claiming innocent. The door won't budge. In fact, they're saying that somebody else is using their symbol. You don't have a key. Can I jump over this? Or maybe I'm supposed to fall down here. Oh, nope, I know what I need to do. There we go. I had to move the piston out of the way to get into the open door. What? Okay, I see what I need to do. I have to hit the lever again when I'm on the other side. But that door opens. And this one won't. What if I go through this door first? It's blocked by another pipe and won't move. In other words, I guess I'll have to go through the other door first. So, that should get us over there now. Does it? No, it just opens up this. Now I can't get to the other side. Can I just jump over here? No? Okay. So much for that idea. Okay, I think I know how I'm gonna get over there. Watch. I think you need the key to move the pipe so that then you can finally solve that old puzzle. Yo! This should be the other side of the room I was just in. That moves the pipe all the way. Puzzle piece! What else is in this room? Nothing. So I guess I have to hit this button now. Because the pipe's no longer blocking it. See? Now we can get back in here and there's a button. Interesting how that is. And this will probably get us into that door. Okay, so far this dungeon is pretty cool. You know, maybe in a few minutes I'll start hating it. <laughs> they start throwing in really annoying puzzles. <laughs> Did I just manage to... Oh, you know what? It's just a new one. That's why. Oh, hello. It didn't work. I got an idea. If I throw the fire at that enemy with the bomb, Why 
is it every one hit knocks me over? But at least now I have a combo. It seems like it's every single hit that can do that. Every single one. And it's just so miserable. <laughs> okay, that's just where I came from. And I did pick up a new shield, too. So I think it only just reduced some of the damage. I don't know if it reduced it by much. Okay, that guy's got a bomb. And that's all. But how the hell am I supposed to get up? Oh, wait a minute. Was that just a new enemy right there? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, sh bullshit! How do I get a new bomb now? Hitting it doesn't work. I think I have to reset the puzzle. That also does not work. Hold on, can I get another bomb or do I have to leave? I need a key here. That door opens, so there's that. Cutscene? You! What are you doing in here? Kick, kick, ruins! Kick, kick, sacred! Kick, kick! Are you listening to me? Kick, kick, ruins! Kick, kick, sacred! Kick, kick! Hey, mister! I'm talking to you! Were you the ones who bombed Paco Village? Who gave you the order? Look at me when I'm talking to you! Turn this way and answer me! Oh, I can't stand these people! I don't think she's caught on that they're being controlled. Oh, there's our key. Maybe... I can light up the bomb... If I use one of these enemies. Oh, pff, Fuck off. Why isn't this one coming down? Okay, now it's coming down. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and kill you. Thank you. What if I throw this really close to you? That didn't work! I guess the bomb just wasn't close enough. Okay, so they're probably going to make this a bit of a miserable puzzle. That will require a little bit of finessing. Careful. If I just put it right over here... 
That's pretty close to the block. Got him. That was a pain in the ass just to get one puzzle piece. And you could tell it was pain. I mean, look at how, how low my health just got. Hey, where did Alexia go? I guess she just ran off. She says I leave without her, huh? Kiki, me win! Kiki, cow prince, Kiki, this year! Well, you're not winning it with that uh, vocabulary. Kiki, ruins, Kiki, sacred, Kiki! This is getting weirder and weirder. Kiki, hard work, Kiki! Good for body, Kiki! I gotta go. <laughs> Elevator is out of service. Oh, I thought that was a trap floor for some reason. I guess I just fall down. <laughs> or not? Oh god, what is this? Ha! Yeah, this is some Donkey Kong vibes right here. So now the elevator should work. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. <laughs> I wonder if there are many people around that watch my video still heard of Limp Bizkit. <laughs> like, it was like pretty good for like some jams when you're a teenager. And then as you grow up, it's like... Wow, he just swore a lot. And just like screamed about it. Damn, this is some weird looking doggos. Dear God, combat is so much better now that I can hit twice. Uh, are you kidding me? You gotta hit on me right away? So if I just touch the tail, without it even swinging anything, it's a hit against me. Wow. That's rough. So that elevator is now available, but this one was always available. What if I take this one first? Hi. Wow! A treasure chest! Better open it up before Flint shows up. What's this? I don't need this. Just my luck. I find a treasure chest, but the only thing inside is one lousy key. What the fuck? How are you this bad at exploring? She seriously said keys suck. And she's going to be the next ruler of this kingdom. Dear Lord. Anyway, let's go grab that key. Wait. Was this the door that I was... This is two? Okay, I don't want to go that way yet. Let's take the other elevator. So maybe this lift leads to where she was, and then I'll get the key. Wow. 
Wow. It could just lay on its back and that attacks you. How does it work like this? So when it's like this, I'm not even able to hit it at all. Oh, that's not the same one. Oh well, it's money. Oh, this is he's back here. Alright, I guess I'll just go back down. Goodbye. <laughs> So I make sure I'm not missing anything while I'm here. I hope it wasn't asking me to do like a running jump and just curl around. Which I'm sure it could be possible. Like that, see? Oh my god, I think they were asking me to do that. They want me to pull some advanced jump. Okay, before I open that door, let me see what was upward. I'm pretty sure I had to do jumps like that on Alundra 1 as well. Nope. Nope. What was the point of all this, then? Shit. What?! So I guess there was, like, no reason to go up there other than use it as a way to reach the key. But I could already reach the key. So that was pointless to me. Excuse me? Gotta find a way to drop down there. God damn it. Okay, I'll take another herb. Oh, sweet money. More of these guys. Tonic! What? Oh, these are brambles? Okay, I was not expecting that. Hey, you wanna come over? What? So my sunburst has a slight delay. That's rough. Okay, what if I take this lift first? I'm gonna ignore you. I did it! I got the button. Ah, now we can get in there. Wait. This poses another issue. What do I light it with? Oh. That's what. I gotta make sure I get it on the block. Well, I guess I didn't even need to get it on the block. It just feels cooler that way. Keys. Let's pop another herb. I honestly don't have to worry that much. 
about my health, because at least I still have tonics, too. Oh, that's what I need the key for. But what else is over that way? It seems I need to burn that to get to that chest, but I don't have anything that can create fire. Am I gonna get something that does that later on? Because this just screams, you're gonna get something that lights fire. We're gonna get you some matches. You're gonna love them. Or get you some flaming hot Cheetos, and then you have to spit them out. Because we'll put that on everything. Even though we have Frank's Red Hot Sauce for that exact purpose! And it looks a little less ghetto. I never had flaming Hot Cheetos, and as much as I love spicy food, I don't know if I can really care to enjoy flaming Hot Cheetos at all. Oh, can't get up that ladder yet. What turn? Also, what's up with this tower? Oh, hold on. Why can't I get over there? Oh, you have to jump. Okay. Oh, it's timed! Oh, okay, I, I messed it up. We gotta do it again. I see what these markings are. They tell you when you're supposed to jump. I don't know this was just a race. Don't you love it when something is timed but it doesn't tell you that it is? Like certain games will just put a timer over there to let you know that it's... That you gotta be fast. Not this one! Oh, just gotta go now. It doesn't matter, I did it anyway. I've already made it to the other side. This cliff actually looks pretty impressive. Now I can get over there. I actually did not mean to stand on that again. But okay. Am I soon gonna get to, like, the head of this tank? Oh my god, I had no time to prepare for that. Shit. Can any of these drop any health for me so I don't have to use all my herbs so early in this? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I think I have to knock these guys into the holes. How the hell am I supposed to do that so easily? Okay, I just gotta let them do it themselves. You know, easier said than done. Hey, get over here. Uh, I thought I could just knock him in there. I'm sure it can be done, but it's not easy. Okay, now he's in there. 
This would have been so much easier if there was a way to pick up enemies. And then I could just throw them in. Maybe I'll try that next time I see more of these scumbags. The hell? Monies. I'm guessing these balls are gonna come down and try to crush me. So what I need to do is time my jumps carefully. That way I don't get hit in midair. And that's done. Did I just see a green light move? Oh, it's a searchlight. There is full healing. We'll take advantage of that. Oh, well, there's Alexia. What are you doing up there? I figured you might want to, you know, help me out. If we're in this together, you're not being a team player. Being all seeking, I better get this treasure before Flint finds out. He's like, I can use this treasure for both of us. Why do I have to be so rude about it? Oh, that almost caught me. Wait, isn't it even a searchlight? Am I gonna give her a fright that she gets knocked down? Cause that'd be funny. Overgrown cow! What do you think you're doing? Passing yourself off as a pirate! Move! Me hate humans! Move! Me kill all humans! That symbol on you! That's the same one I saw on the flying ship! What do you mean, Ruby? What's going on? She is attempting to convey that this mechanical bovine is in the service of Mephisto. Ah, Mephisto! What's that creep up to? Huh? You wanna fight? I'll give you a fight! What? what? What the? Nice tidy whities <laughs> Do you wear them every time you're out to kill humans? Uh oh. We gotta run. Run away from Mutox! Use the left- Use the directional buttons or left stick, jump with the X button. Jump to break item holders and get as many items as you can. Is this a mini game? Good to know there are items that I can't prepare for. You can't zoom out either. So I'm missing every item. If you see these markings, get ready to jump. Oh, and the rockets give you a speed burst too. Yeah, this. How the frick are you supposed to get every item? If they don't tell you where they are until it's too late like that, see? 
Oh my god, if you fall even once, it's a fail. Alright, I messed up. We gotta do it again. Okay, I got an idea. Maybe because I'm holding down. Yeah, that was the actual problem. Oh, okay. Oh, shoot. Checkpoint. Okay, that just slowed it down. Alright, so far so good. Ah, I messed up, we gotta do it again. <laughs> so what are the tonics that I get? Do I keep those? For like consumables? Cause so, oh, that's actually pretty cool. I had to ask myself, is the money really worth it? Okay, that was mean! Let's put a rocket boost right near a pit. You have to get ready to react in, like, one frame. Hope you memorize the course. Okay, so maybe I shouldn't be in the middle so much! Oh! That's bullshit. That is pure bullshit. I was near the checkpoint too, that makes it even worse. Oh great, now the tonic appeared on that side! How the hell do I get enough time to jump when that happens? Okay, that time I used both rocks. Oh my god, it happened again! That's the, s the third time that happened! The same trap! Okay, the fact that you can fail if you fall down even one time does not make this very exciting anymore. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that was probably a rock, wasn't it? Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh no. That one got me. One coming? Thank you. <laughs> okay, that one didn't give me a chance. So I guess some of the rockets are put there specifically to kill you. So now if I see a rocket, I gotta get ready to jump immediately. And somehow that still killed me, too. Okay. Okay, I'm getting better at it at least! Am I- am I at the end? I did it. <laughs> I made a rainbow. You got three tonics.
Took you forever, but at least you get 380 gold. Number of items missed. My mother can do better than you. How much? How would you go piss off, game? I'm fighting for my life here. I didn't come here to get everything. I'm just trying to not die. Oh yeah, now we gotta fight anyway. Well, at least I got those extra tonics. <laughs> Let's see how tough this boss is compared to the demon cat. Whoa. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh, he can actually get knocked out by his own rock. I think I should just let him use the rock against himself. What? Oh, he can actually just block my melee strikes when he's conscious. So he gets full recovery if I hit him a single time. Well, in that case, I'll just bear off just using my charge. Okay, never mind. Wow. Wow, okay. Not giving me any time to get up. <laughs> Are you kidding me? He's got way more range than I do. <laughs> okay, that time that Abrock actually got me. So I can't really do anything against him until he's dizzy from his own rock. <sighs> I gotta stop using that chart. That dash attack. Because every time I do it, I end up getting hurt from COLLISION! A game like this should not have collision damage. Yeah, just use the combo. Do you have any new tricks up your sleeve? Or are you just like a one-trick bull? Good lord, look at those spaghetti legs. Oh, another phase. Is he taunting me? For me, he's still using the same tactics. Maybe I gotta wait longer for a rock. Whoa! Now he becomes the ball. That did over 60 damage! It homes! It freaking homes! Oh my god. Alright, what well, about I just keep moving? Oh, I should have just used a combo. So I don't. Excuse me? How did you hit me from there? I was moving. Okay, I think this is the rhythm I gotta do. Just use my regular two-hit combo. And I'll possibly do at most 20 damage to him. Gotta 
love the the real damage difference where two hits can do like maybe a combined 16 damage and one hit does 64. That's a massive disparity in damage, I'm just saying. Granted, I am playing this on normal. I wonder what the difference in damage it would have been if I was playing on easy instead. See, the charge attack would have been more viable if I can actually move and charge at the same time. Unfortunately, I cannot do that. Oh, change direction. There we go. Seems like he only hits a wall three times. No, I think that's it. Because he went flying on the first hit. Is he snoring? There, I beat him. What a pain in the ass that was. Wait. Please tell me that's Lao. Was that guy missing a bull? Because <laughs> that's actually pretty wild. Give me those financial gains. Oh, one got away. Big life crest. So I think I'll bump me to 425 HP. Yeah! Hold up, was there only one exit in this room? What the? I'm back here. I'm guessing I need to come back later when I find out how to burn down those vines. Flint! Thank goodness! You're okay! Maybe there's a way and I missed it. So did you kill that bull monster? No, well, technically yes, but no. Huh? You let it get away? You should have finished it off. What? It turned into a normal bull? You mean just like Mephisto's cat? The three pirates said something about it being the warlock's handiwork. But why did it bomb the village? I don't think we're going to find any answers here. Let's go back to Toralito. Meanwhile... Lo, where did you run off to? <coughs> huh? That melodic moo. Could it be? It's him! It's him! I know that moo anywhere! Lau is back! Lau! Oh, Lau, you're back! I like how he just walks off the cliff. <laughs> oh, I missed you so much. Did you miss me too? <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> Well, I hope you're feeling strong. It's time for you to make your triumphant return. <sighs> I knew it. It was Lao after all. Alright, so I think before we head on out, 
I might as well take this opportunity to save and call it an episode. Because it's been going around 45 minutes. Alright, so let's stop it here, and in the next part, we'll uh, see what's going on in Toroledo. See everyone, thanks for watching.